in this lesson we are going to talk about the position vector this is an important topic under the first chapter of dynamics course uh, which is the planar kinematics of rigid body okay so let's say we have two points this is point a and here we have point b so how do we um, determine the position of point b with respect to point a so what we want is we want to know what is what is the position of point B with respect to point A. The, we can draw an arrow from the origin pointing towards point B. Okay, so this will be the this will be the the position vector and how do we write this we write this with uh, the position vector is indicated with uh, the letter r small r and since point b is the point of interest and point a is the origin or the reference point we write this as r of b slash a which means that this is the position vector of and this is the position of point B with respect to point A or this is the position of B from A. And do not forget this small uh, arrow on top, uh, on top of R indicating that this is a vector. So this, um, the position of this, we can uh, represent it with uh, this triangle here. Okay, uh, and this is, let's say, 0 0.3 meter, and this is 0 0.4 meter. And we can already define our coordinate system to be positive uh, to the right for x direction and positive going up for y axis. So here, how do we write... Uh, the position vector of point B with respect to point A or in the other words what is RB slash A equals to in this case um, we can see that RB slash A has 0 0.3 uh, component of X pointing this way and it also have a component of Y pointing up so we can write this as or before that uh, if you recall for x-axis the unit vector for x-axis is i represented by i and the unit vector for y-axis is represented by j and you notice that there is a, this is written with a hat symbol on top to indicate that this is a unit vector is the unit vector this is also a unit vector okay so rb slash a is then equal to 0 0.3 meter in x axis so this will be written as 0 0.3 i positive because it is pointing to the right and x axis we have defined that x axis is positive pointing to the right and for y axis it is positive pointing up and in here we also have positive pointing up so this will be also positive of 0 0.4 now the unit vector is j and this has a unit of meter so this is the position of a uh, position vector of point b with respect to point a or rb slash a we can also uh, determine uh, if we want 
the position of point A with respect to point B. In this case, the arrow now becomes like this. Okay, this will be point B. Point B now becomes the, the origin or the reference point, and this will be point A. So the arrow is now the uh, in the opposite direction as what we have before. And we have here 0 0.4 meters and here 0 0.3 meters. Okay. And this is now no longer pointing up. It is now pointing down. And this is also pointing to the left. So in this case, this is RA slash B. Okay, so RA slash B will be equal to, now this is pointing to the left in the opposite direction of what we have defined uh, earlier. So this will be equal to negative 0.3i and the y component is also pointing down which means that it is also negative so negative 0.4 j the unit is meter okay so that is the position vector let's take a look at some examples let's say we call this as point O over here and what we want is what we want is we want to know what is R A slash O what is the uh, position of point A with respect to point O or from point O so we can draw a we can draw an arrow like this. This will be the arrow head at point A. Okay. So this is R A slash O. And uh, still using this coordinate system. So in this case, we see that uh, R A slash O only has uh, one component which is in x axis and uh, the the magnitude is 3 meter so this will be equal to 3 i meter that is r a slash o what about if we want uh, let's say we want to know what is the position of point b r b with respect to a now this is R B slash A. In this case, we we will draw another uh, arrow or position vector. Okay. Now uh, the arrow head will be at point B. This will be the arrow head, and now the origin is at point A. So this will be R b slash a position vector so how do we determine this uh, of course this vector here can be uh, separated into components okay we can have the x component pointing this way okay and we can have this y component pointing this way So this will be the x component, this will be the y component of the vector rb slash a. And so what we need to know is what are the values. So here in this case, we have the length of a to b is 2 meters and there is um, 60 degrees angle here. So basically this will also be 60 degrees. Okay, to get the value of x x will be equal to 2 meters multiply with the cos of 60 degrees so this is x so it will be having a unit vector i 
and for y axis or y component uh, oh, I'm sorry this is pointing to the left so this should be negative and for y component is pointing down it, it should also be negative and this can be calculated by multiplying 2 meters with sine of 60 degrees and it is in y axis so it has um, unit vector of j so this is 1i 2 cos 60 is 1 oh, sorry minus 1i minus 2 sine 60 is 1.732 so this is 1.732 j meter 